Hey guys, just want to tell you about a couple knives today. Um, I was at a gun show in Grand Prairie a couple years back and uh, came across J West Custom Knives. So uh, I liked what he had there. So I actually went back to his place and checked out his whole collection and uh, ended up picking out a couple and my girlfriend ended up getting one too. Um, so I'll just show you guys quick here what they look like. My everyday carry is right here on the side. You guys have seen that in other videos. It's a 1095 uh, spring steel. I'm not sure what wood it is. I don't remember actually. You can kind of see the heat treat across there. J West Custom Knives is at a Spruce Grove, Alberta. Very nice work. Very sharp right out of the box. When you buy them, he also gives you uh, some sharpening supplies and shows you how to use them as well. This is the Bowie knife I got. It's actually made out of a uh, old farrier's rasp. I love this holster here. It's quite handy how it just slips in and out like that, but very easy to get just the blade out too. With the pouch like that, it's handy because you can have it, you know, out and about and not have the blade exposed. You could easily put it into a pocket. You can slip it into your belt. Very, very handy. I love that pouch just clips onto your belt or onto your belt loop so that when you lean forward it doesn't fall forward. Very handy where it's placed. Show you there. That's a maple burl handle with a brass guard. You still see some of the rasp. <laughs> Hardened through the blade section soft through the rest so that it doesn't break so that it doesn't break very beautiful knife you should check him out j west custom knives he has an instagram page and a facebook his instagram is at j west custom knives he posts knives he's making at the time on there so you could probably check out some pretty cool stuff This is a little one my girlfriend got. It's actually a stainless steel. They call it a trout knife. I oil all my knives with uh, olive oil since they're a high carbon steel. Don't want them to rust. That way it's still food safe. He takes great detail in his work. They're very beautiful knives. Usually very high polish, very, very sharp. He'll even teach you how to sharpen them. Like I said, um, the pouches too, takes a lot of time and work effort into those. Very nicely done, very nicely finished. Very nicely um, engraved or embroidered or punched, I guess. The fit on these pouches are just amazing. It's not going to fall out. Super tight. Not going to rattle around. Even on the Bowie. And then if you fall too, it's not going to puncture through because of the way the leather is. It's going to hold it up against the pommel there. That way you fall out of your tree stand, you're not going to stab yourself. You can see all the layering in here. So he builds it up. To accommodate that. 
thickness of the handle. Just a beautiful punch. So yeah, you can ask him to make it however you want and, and work with you and get you what you want. Really great guy, very friendly. So check out his stuff. Thanks again for watching my video. I feel like you can't be my camera person.